Nissan is so close. The perennial number three among Japanese automakers was, well, number three in the compact crossover segment last year, with the Rogue selling 287,190 units to the Honda CR-V's 345,647 and the Toyota RAV4's 315,412. But so far this year, the Rogue has overtaken the RAV4, with 241,619 units sold to the Toyota's 230,942, and the CR-V is in reach, with 263,493 sales through nine months. Again, so close. Once refreshed 2017 Rogues go on sale, Nissan could close that gap. While a new hybrid variant hogs the spotlight, look for a review soon, there are also a number of updates to the standard model. Driving Notes Virtually every change to the 2017 Rogue relates to design or equipment, leaving the mechanical bits unchanged. A fine 2.5-liter, naturally aspirated four-cylinder with 170 horsepower and 175 pound-feet of to work works with Nissan's Stronic continuously variable transmission and standard front or optional all-wheel drive. Nissan left the electric power-assisted steering and multi-link rear suspension alone, too. So yeah, the new Rogue drives just as well as the old one. Nissan claims it has quieted the already quiet Rogue for 2017, thanks to an array of NVH upgrades. But the claimed improvements, a 9% reduction in road noise, an 8% drop in wind noise, and a 6% decrease in engine noise, are so modest they're hard to appreciate. This is a quiet car, but most drivers won't notice the impact of denser rear glass, more dash insulation, thicker carpets and increased sound deadening in the headliner. What you will notice is the updated styling. Nissan hit the main points on the exterior, adding Altima-like LED headlight accents, a more prominent V-Motion grille, and a revised front bumper.